<laughs> Sorry. Oh no, no, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Yeah, I'm nervous. Yeah. I'm nervous. Okay. That's a lot of yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a lot. Good. All right. Hi. Go. Hi, everybody. I'm Deborah Messing. And if you're like me, you know that there's nothing more important in our country right now than the election that's less than two weeks away. Um, in order to win, we really need to win the midterm elections. And it's the election that is most often skipped. Uh, the most effective way to do that, to get people to come out and vote, is to call them one-on-one -on -one conversations. And so right now, I am about to do some phone banking to California with my friend Morgan J. Freeman. Hello. And we are going to call, and we're using a, a tool called uh, CAcounts.org. CA as in California. CAcounts.org which is a website um, by the Courage Campaign. And so all you need to start is you need a laptop and your phone, and then you're ready to go. And uh, so you just sign up and you're gonna choose phone bank, and then you're gonna choose phone bank from home. And then you're ready to go. Um, and then you have to choose your candidate, and today we are calling for Katie Porter. She's our candidate. So you log in with your email address and the password is CA counts. And now we're live. And um, we go right to our first call and we have our names. They give us the name of the person who we're gonna call and they give you uh, a script to follow. See here? And you know, I'm nervous. Are you nervous? <clears throat> I'm nervous too. <laughs> and I think it's important, there's 10 seats up for grabs, right, in California that could turn blue. And actually, I'm on with another candidate, with Josh Harder, so we'll be going after oh, two different candidates to support the Democrats that are registered to vote and make sure they get out to vote and understand the issues. Yeah, that's and the most important thing. And the great thing is that if you're nervous about doing this, the whole script is here, and if the person you're talking to has questions about issues, those issues are addressed also on this piece of paper. So don't feel intimidated, like you have to know everything, you have to have everything memorized. You don't. Everything is laid out right here for you. And you could do it with a friend, a family member, any, anywhere. You can log in like we're doing right now and just gonna make some calls. That's right. Probably feel good. I think it's gonna feel good. <laughs> okay. okay, so now you're gonna here watch go. us. Okay, so I got a voicemail, so they're not there. So what they have here is all I do is I go up and I check off not home so that they understand when they go back that no one has ever spoken to her and so they'll try it again later. So they have all that, that's, that information. So now I have Mohua, Mohua, what a great name. And they're telling me on this that she is 56 and a Democrat. We're calling Democrats um, to make sure they actually go to the polls. Because a lot of times people just don't make it a priority, even though they, they really are Democrats and they want change in the country. It just, it just doesn't happen. And so these calls, they make a real difference. They get people to go out. And that's why we're asking you guys to do whatever you can. Another voicemail. Okay, so again, not home. Okay. Now I'm gonna call Manisha, who is female, 53 years old, right, and old. a Democrat. You know, California is um, really the most important state um, that, that could really determine whether or not we win the House back. And that's why we're, we're focusing our energies on California. I was also born and raised in California. You were where? Yeah, Long Beach, Southern California. Oh, look at you. Mm. California 
your baby. Whole family's still there. We'll be calling them too. I was gonna say, have you, have you enlisted them? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. I wonder if we're gonna get anybody live. Well, I've gotten two live people so far. Okay. This this voice ma this vo voicemail is full, and there's no more space. So I will I will go and push that. And now I'm given another name, Nasrin. Nasrin is female and 55 oh. years old. Two eight one two eight eight one. Okay. Come on, Nasrin. I want to talk to you. Okay, I'm going to call Angel. Disconnected or no longer in service. Okay, so this is different. So now I go up to the top of the page and I have a chance. I, I say it's they have bad number. Do not call, moved, deceased, not home, refused survey. <coughs> Hi, may I speak with Angel, please? Hi, may I speak with Angel, please? Can you hear me? Oh, hi, Angel. My name is Morgan, and I'm a volunteer calling voters like you to support the Democratic candidates for Congress. Do you have a minute? Oh, no English? Um, a tiny little bit? <laughs> oh. Oh no, well. I'm calling Sabrina. Can, um, are you going to be voting on November 6th? No English? Okay, um, have a great day. Okay. I mean, I guess it wouldn't hurt if I knew a couple languages. <laughs> I'm calling Sabrina. She is 58 and Democrat. I took Spanish in high school and I'm feeling really guilty right now that I didn't, I couldn't help but, you. Right. She actually said she spoke Arabic. Oh, I don't know any Arabic. I don't know any Arabic either. Uh, well, I, I shot a film in Morocco, um, Shokram. That's not helpful though. Um, is is votar the infinitive for to vote in Spanish? Is it? I think so. Do you say? Uh, we could open up uh, Google Translate. Puede, I should open. Okay. Puedo a votar para. Okay, this is not a good number anymore. It's not even the right bad number. Okay. So Dabbe, oh gosh, I hope I pronounced that correctly. Let's see if she's home. It's fascinating that they're all women on this list so far. Women are gonna save the country. Hi there, I was um, trying to reach Amy, if she's available. Hello, um, I'd love to speak oh, with Sardar. Okay. I'm sorry, available. sir, thank you. Hi, um, my name is Deborah, and I am a volunteer calling um, people like you who support Democratic candidates for Congress. Do you have a few minutes to talk? You're going to work. Okay, well, I hope you'll um, consider Katie Porter. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. There, there you go. There you go. Answering. Huh, what is this? Oh. Okay. Not home. And, okay. Here we go. Now I have Samantha. I have Paula. Seven, one, four, eight, four. Hi, 
Hi guys. Oh. Sending kisses right back. You guys can do this too. Hello. Just like you. We're, we're, we're doing this. We're doing what we can. That's bad a bad number. number. Disconnected. Okay. All right, I'm going to call Amanda. Dis disconnected. In Fresno. Brina? Brina? B-R-Y-N-A. How would you pronounce that? Brina? Brina? Brina. Okay. Six, one, seven, six. Brina is 57. And a Democrat. Jessica. Voicemail. Okay, not home. Okay. So you can see that. Wow, a busy signal. Oh, that's I exciting. Gotten one of those in a long time. <laughs> I'll put it on speaker. Wow. I'm calling Sherry. So you see, you're, you're not getting a person every time. It's not. But that's okay. Every person counts. got a voicemail. Okay, so that means I'm going up here to the top of the screen and saying not home. End call. And they're giving me someone else. Her name is Christine. And I'm going to call her Ooh. now. Voicemail. 9158. Come on, Christine. Erica. Oh, you're sweet. Oh, I don't read Japanese. Thank you, Nico. <laughs> I wish you would call me. Are you a voter <laughs> in California? Because I might. Christine's not home. Christine's not home. Okay. Okay, not home. Hi there, I was trying to reach Erica. Now I'm calling Andrea. Oh, I'm sorry to bother you. Thank you. Are you getting like messages on the... Yeah. Yeah, what are they saying? Are they asking questions? Um, they've asked a few questions that he's answering. Okay, great. And then just thanking you for all you're doing. Go girl, keep up the awesome work, Deborah. You can do it too. Okay, we're calling Andrea. I got Melissa. I'm talking to my Instagram live also at the same time, so that's why I'm looking down. Hi. Hey, John. Um, is Andrea there? Uh, excuse me? Is this the wrong number? Oh, she's working. Okay. Uh, when do you expect her home? Bad number. Okay, thank you. Um, my name is Deborah. I'm a volunteer calling voters um, like you who support the Democratic candidates for Congress. And we're just calling on behalf of Katie Porter. Oh, okay. Well, um, thank you so much for your time. Bye-bye. Okay, well, she was at work, and I think that was her adult son. And uh, he said that they're Republicans, so to scratch uh, them off the list. So I'm going to put them down uh, for a pose, because that's here. 
and moving on to Narges. She is 60. So one, four, two, eight, one, two, four, one, eight. The most important thing is really being courteous no matter what. Thank you guys. Okay, I'm getting a voicemail, so I'm not gonna leave a message. And I'm just gonna go to the top of the page and write not home. Not and home. They give me another name. Her name is Veronica. Two, eight, one, nine, three, nine. See, it's, it's, it's really not that hard to do this. And even if you do it just for a half hour, you know, it really, it really helps. All right, Shanita. Aren't these great names? Yeah. She sounds so nice. It's a voicemail. Yeah, well. That number. Gilda. I'm calling Gilda. Melanie. Voicemail. Bad number. Okay. So I go to not home. The other great thing about this is that at the very top of the screen, it tells you where the polling place is for this particular candidate. So if they're planning on voting but they don't know where to go, you have the information right there and the address for them. So that's it, it's it's just really important to help out, help people who might be confused. And of course, don't forget that Lyft and Uber are giving free rides to the polls. So for anybody out there who needs a ride, it's free, which is spectacular. Okay, now I'm calling Marilyn. Marilyn, is that one four? She's 51, says she's a Democrat. So this information may not be accurate. Like the last woman that I called, she was a Republican. Okay, I reached a number that's been disconnected, no longer in service, so I push bad number. Save information. So now they have information for the next election that that's not the right information. Now I'm gonna call Stephanie. Cool things you can do this anywhere and you feel like you're contributing and there's no way to wake up on the 7th of November and feel like you didn't at least try that's right you know and, uh, I've had that feeling a few times and it feels horrible so just doing this it feels good it's a good thing to do okay I'm calling Christine
see lots of thumbs up. Hugs from Mexico. Gracias. Christine, she's not home. She's got her voicemail. Go to the top of the page. Not home. Not home. Okay, Nancy, I'll call Nancy. I guess that's good news. That means that people have jobs, right? Um, okay, we're calling. Bad number. Laura. Okay. Calling Laura. Hope. Uh, Hope's got to pick up. Not a working number. Mishi is next. Okay. Same track, but <laughs> mm, another voicemail. At least we're also weeding out the bad numbers so That's the system right. won't mm -hmm. be more efficient. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been um, doing text banking, um, which I love doing because I can do it on my bed, watching TV anytime, day or night. And I've been getting a lot of you know, responses of saying, you know, bad number. Voicemail. Or wrong number, or I've moved out of state. And, um, and that, they have all the responses that you need. And you can say, okay, well, if you've moved out of state, can you please remind people who still live in your old state to consider Katie Porter or whomever else you're, you're trying to, um, like Jackie Rosen, or people who you want to try and get people to, uh, remember to go to the polls and vote for. All right, I'm calling Lindsay Fox. So Christy is... In Modesto, home. California. Not home. I have an Erica. Two Ericas. That's right. Six, nine, four, seven, two, one, nine, Not home. It's ringing. I'm getting a message. Nicole. Okay. She is not home. So I'm going down here and I am checking off not home. Hmm. And then you push the button that says end call save information. It goes into the system and then boop up comes a brand new name. Three, and this person four, is nine, Samina. Five, nine, three, nine, nine, seven, four, nine, Desiree. three, nine, eight. Come on, Samina. Let's see what you're saying. We will stop the injustice, yes. Two. We will stop corruption. That's what we're trying to do. I, I don't know that language. Chara. 
Okay, it's another voicemail. So I go to the top and I say not home. It's as easy as that. Hey Morgan, you have a fan on here. I have a fan? Yeah. Oh, that's so nice. What's the, what's the comment? It says, uh, oh my God, hot guy behind you. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Flattered. That's another reason to do this. <laughs> is that you know you get into groups and you never know who you're going to be sitting next to doing this. Yeah, log you in. Know, who needs apps? Who needs swipe left, swipe right? <laughs> you have California accounts. That's right. Perfect. <laughs> okay. You know it's not easy meeting people these days. At least you know that you're going to be meeting like-minded people. Okay. I'm trying I'm Barry. Barry is 54. She is says she's a Democrat. We'll see. It's ringing. There's an asterisk next to her name. I'm not really sure what that means. Um, Teresa. I'm voting Democrat. Oh, great. Okay, I got another voicemail. I'm feeling this one. You are? So, yeah. Come on. It's be a good conversation. Okay. Remember, you get a compliment on your glasses. Oh, thank you. Um, they're from uh, Face a Face. Cool. S spelled face a face. Yeah. It's, I know it sounds fancy. It's perfect phone banking eyewear. Thank you so much. Um, okay, I've got another not home. Oh. <laughs> uh -oh. For for, for Morgan's fans. There we go. <laughs> there you go. I wear. <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm calling no. Aaliyah. That's a beautiful name. No. 7371. Melody. There we go. Aaliyah? 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 Aaliyah. I think it's Aaliyah. Uh, hello, is this Aaliyah? Um, my name is Deborah, and I am a volunteer calling voters like you who support Democratic candidates for Congress. And I'm just uh, uh, hi, seeing, speak with Melody, I'm calling please. on behalf of Katie Porter, who is running uh, against your current representative, who votes with Democratic Trump 99% like of the yourself. time, um, including an increase in oh, God, health care premiums. And yeah, I was bye. wondering if you are going to be voting for Katie on November 6th. You're not voting at all this year. Can you can you tell me why? Oh, you did not register. Will, will you be registering t so that you can vote the next time? It's so important that your voice be heard. You will? Okay, 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 good luck, bye-bye. Oh, that makes me sad. Yeah, getting registered, it's so important. So important. I mean, it's it's our civic duty to make sure that our voice is heard. Because if we don't vote, then we're basically letting other people decide for us what our country is going to be about, what we care about, what we defend, what we protect. And those people who are voting may not feel the way that you do about the environment, about women's right to choose, about um, health care and pre-existing conditions being covered. I mean, you can go on and on and on, but um, so that's why your voice needs to be heard. Okay, so we're moving on. And because she's not registered, I'm gonna go up here and say, huh, it does not have an option. I am calling Darcy Slack in Modesto, California. Deceased, not home, refused surveyed, Spanish speaker. I don't know what to put, other. What do I put? She, she's not registered. I also got someone very ill. I wasn't sure. Can where you leave it unchecked? That. Let's see. Let's see if I can leave it unchecked. No, I can't. Um. So maybe choose other. No, um, not other lang language barrier. Bad, not bad number, because that is her Refuse number. survey, maybe, or not home. Nice. Okay, let's do that. 
minute. Yeah, they said to put refused. Okay, great. One minute. Okay, guys, we're going to do this for about one more minute. Okay. okay. All right. One more minute. And Not home. my next person is Vaishali. Okay. Marie. What's going on? I'm calling uh, voters in California to try and remind them to vote, and I'm calling on behalf of Katie Porter, um, and this person is not home. So I'm going to check off up here, not home, and end call, and then a whole new, new name is gonna come up, and it has a whole, a whole text for me. I got another not home. Um, I'm gonna to try to call one more during our session Katie here. Porter. Sharon. He's calling for a different candidate, but California is so vital. So folks are asking where they can get your shirt. So that's ah. votegear.com, right? Votegear.com is where you can buy this spectacular t-shirt that says vote, our future depends on it. And it helps uh, Courage Campaign get out the vote in California. Yes. Gotta buy in the next couple of days, votegear.com. That's right. VoteGear.com helps get out the vote in California. In California. And California is the most important state right now to help us win back the, the House. And um, so we have 10 candidates uh, who we are hoping to, um, our Democratic candidates, to win. And that will help us immeasurably win back the House. And so this next 10 days, it's, it's, just, it's just everything you can give. It's only 10 days, you know it's gonna end, and call, text bank, go knock on doors, volunteer, um, remind people that you can, they can get free rides to the polls from Uber or Lyft, so that should not be a concern anymore. And, um, and just get people excited, because it's an exciting thing to vote. It's an exciting thing to make your voice heard. And uh, it's it's important. So thank you. Any parting words? Yeah. No. Just uh, never think that it's just going to happen because you feel like it has to happen. Um, all our votes matter. And if you want to end family separations, if you don't like a lot of the stuff you've been seeing lately on the news, if you don't like a lot of the rhetoric, if it scares you, you got to vote blue. Yeah, there's a lot at stake, and and your voice counts. So please vote. Amen. All right. Thank you guys for Bye. watching. Bye. Thank you guys. Bye. Bye. Thanks for Thanks watching. Everyone. Bye.